NASA sharing some never before seen images from the launch of Artemis 1. This footage shows the moments the Orion capsule separated from the final rocket stage and went toward the moon. Pretty cool stuff. Tonight, NASA says Orion has reached the halfway point and it's performing even better than they expected, at least so far. So if all goes according to plan, it will reach the moon on Monday. But before it starts its loop, it needs to complete some final tests in deep space. New 6's Troy Campbell is at Space View Park with the update. NASA says they're excited about some of the images they're starting to receive from the spacecraft. Just a few days after it launched from Kennedy Space Center, just across the river from where we're standing, NASA says they're preparing to make the decision on whether to enter the moon's orbit. The mission in just three short days is proceeding uh, and, and exceeding expectations. Artemis mission manager Mike Serafin saying this image of the Orion spacecraft from 975 miles above Earth is another triumph for the Artemis mission. You can probably hear it in my voice. It's very exciting just for us in Mission Control. Uh, it's, it's been a very exciting mission. New images also show the view from Artemis as it blasted off from the launch pad and during its separation stage as it continued to gain altitude into space. Flight Director Jeff Radigan saying, despite several technical issues, NASA is prepared to move to the next step for the mission, entering lunar orbit from the dark side of the moon. Uh, this is absolutely a critical burn. It's one that Orion has to perform. But of course, it's got uh, the Ohms engine, which is the primary way of doing the burn, as well as uh, additional auxiliary engines, such that if we have an issue with the Ohms engine, the auxiliary engines will pick up and complete the burn. During the monumental maneuver, NASA Mission Control will be unable to communicate with the spacecraft for 34 minutes. In terms of our readiness to commit to the distant retrograde orbit um, and the decision gate tomorrow, there is nothing that sticks out as a as a, um, a clear no go or a lean against against the um, against what we've seen. NASA also says the blast from the powerful rocket ended up blowing off the doors of the launch tower elevator. NASA also says if a decision is made on Saturday to enter the lunar orbit, the actual burn won't take place until Monday. At Space View Park in Titusville, Troy Campbell getting results news six.